A young USF student is studying molecular biology to one day find a cure for Friedrich's ataxia, a neuromuscular disease. It's an illness both he and his twin sister were diagnosed with as kids. And he's now asking for your help. When I walk, it looks a little disturbed because my gait is off. So if you see me walking, I walk a little funny. 20-year-old Christian Mauger studies cellular and molecular biology at USF, hoping one day to find a cure for Friedrich's ataxia, an illness he was diagnosed with at just nine years old. Basically, our nerves are slowly deteriorating, and we are undersupplying energy. So we're always very fatigued. And tired. Christian's muscles don't properly communicate with his brain, despite years of undergoing testing. It gets worse over time, and you slowly lose abilities that have become known to you. <sighs> That's very just hard for you because you've learned how to do something like ride a bike, but then your body just forgets or it can't. Christian lives on his own, but his twin sister, Isabel, who also has FA, is now dependent on others. She lives with my parents still in the same house and she uses a wheelchair and she just needs help in almost every aspect of life. And he doesn't like to think about his own body continuing to deteriorate. This will eventually happen to me. Hopefully not, but currently it will. And it's kind of scary. Christian is thankful for FARA, Friedrich's Ataxia Research Alliance, a nonprofit group that helps all FA patients and raises money for research. And that is just huge because you, sure, you can help me when I fall, you can pick me up, you can lend me a helping hand, but if you can find a cure or even a treatment, that's like unthinkable, beyond words. And Christian prays for a cure. Not just for myself, but other people with my disease. This Saturday, September 28th, I'll be emceeing the Farah Energy Ball. If you would like to attend or donate to this nonprofit group, I posted a link on our website. Just go to abcactionnews.com.